For the Thompson test, we're testing the integrity of the Achilles tendon. Uh, some of the major muscles that make up the Achilles tendon are the gastrocnemius, whose job is to plantar flex the foot during movement. So if you think of a toe off, uh, that would be plantar flexion. And so in order to do this, to mimic the action of the muscle, we want to essentially shorten the muscle belly itself. And when we do that, we just put our hands here on the calf, the muscle, and we squeeze. And what that should do is mimic shortening, creating plantar flexion of the foot. And if you notice, when we squeeze, we get the heel moving back towards us, the toes pushing out towards the wall here, mimicking the action of the muscles. If the Achilles tendon is intact, then the foot should move. However, if it is not intact, it will usually just lie limp there without any movement whatsoever. You can partially tear your Achilles tendon, so you'll want to compare bilaterally if you suspect that that is the injury. You will get some movement with a partial tear, but it will be diminished compared to the bilateral leg. So that is the Thompson test.